Question worth asking. Black Spiral Dancers. We have more than one of them on the board of directors now. More than there are of my kind. I can't say that this is a particularly pleasant thing. Their hygiene is known to be awful. But Black Spiral Dancers do serve a very useful purpose because what they have in intel on the Garou Nation is far outranking any source that we could get from elsewhere. Let me tell you a story, as I was told it. Once upon a time there was a tribe. It was known as the White Howlers. They no longer exist. Because the White Howlers saw the light of day and the dark of night, and what they realised was that the worm was coming, and it was better to be on the winning side. So they descended into the bowels of the earth, and they sacrificed their young, their females. They said that they would give anything to be the chosen warriors of the worm, to save our planet, and deliver it to the worm's moor. That's what I was told. Why would I doubt that? A black spiral dancer tell me. They're known for their honesty. <laughs> Needless to say, the outcome was that surviving white howlers became the black spiral dancers. The black spiral dancers then fought against the Garou Nation and it took many, many years before they did become the chosen champions of the worm until relatively recently, by human reckoning, the skull pigs were still the favoured tool of the worm. And it's worth using that word in describing Black Spiral Dancers. Tool. They are tools. They are blunt instruments. They do not l have the subtlety, the nuance, the intellect that Pentex, that various other servants of the worm do. In fact, give me ten Fomori or one Black Spiral Dancer. I'll take the Fomori. More easy to control. Because the Black Spiral Dancer, while it is a good source of intelligence, and yes, they can surprise the enemy with their gifts, they also surprise us. They're difficult to predict. They can take their rage out on us just as easy as they can on the foe. They're quite uncontrollable. Quite rage fueled. Who does that sound like to you? Does that mean I would be rid of them? No, 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 no. They're too useful. Does that mean I would rather they were working in the same building as me? Definitely not. No, they could tear through the wall and rip my head off probably without even thinking about it, without blinking, which is something I need to get into the habit of doing. See, I do remember sometimes. Now the Black Spiral Dancers, they do, of course, have their uses. They are explosive devices. When you find out where the enemy is, you send in the artillery before you send in the foot soldiers. You don't want to bomb your own men. No, no. What you do is send in the black spirals. Because the black spirals revel in destruction. They revel in chaos. And what's more, they seem to think they've already won. Now, I can't deny them their hubris. We are very close. Very close these nights to finally seeing the scourge of Garu wiped clean from the earth so that we can rebuild it anew in our image. It's very nearly there. But the Black Spiral Dancers, some of them are already convinced that it's happened. That they can start relaxing. They can start pursuing other avenues. They can start enterprising on their own interests. It's made several of them slothful. Several of them have become very languid indeed. Languorous black spiral dancers, prone to luxury, prone to decadence. Some of them have decided they will rise up through the ranks in Pentex. We've defeated the foe, let's now claim a hefty salary and treat our kinfolk to a slap up meal. That seems to be a prevailing thought among some black spiral dancers, especially the urban ones. Let me tell you something we haven't won yet. The Black Spiral Dancers can afford to think it. It does actually leave them slightly more docile than they were before. But we do need to convince them that the Garu still need fighting. Until every one of their more white knight peers is still well, is eliminated. We just want them all gone, every one of them, or in a lab. They need to keep fighting for us. They need to keep fighting for the worm. For our masters. 
<laughs> it's difficult to manipulate a black spiral dancer. I found out once what they did for breeding. You know, the black spirals, they are monsters. There are various monstrous acts, of course, that we at Pentex could be said to perpetrate, but that's all a matter of perspective, really. It depends on whose side you're on in this war, and wars, all sides think they're the good guys, you understand. But Black Spiral Dancers, they do monstrous things. They kidnap kinfolk from other werewolves and they pen them under the ground where they mate with them, sometimes forcibly, in order to breed their selected metis. They like the inbred, they like the reject, the runt with the mutations, because almost every black spiral dancer I've ever met has had quite the obvious mutation. You think Nosferatu are bad, you should see a black spiral dancer attempting to pose as a homid. Or indeed anything else. I believe me, the monobrow is the least of it. The sixth finger is the least of it. It's the spines. It's the stench. It's the ooze. It's the pustules. It's the scars across the face that glow with the green bale fire. Oh, they're manip manipulation of bane bale fire. Bale fire. That's what they call it. That's something. It's a weapon that we cannot harness, or we have not so far, not sufficiently. Some Fomori seem to have a certain adeptness for it, but at Pentex we would like to be able to cultivate Balefire, grow it, fuel it, and create a plant with it so that it can be produced, put into weapons. No, the Black Spiral Dancers seem to create it from nowhere, not dissimilar to the way Garu do similar with other of their gifts. And it is a reminder that while Balefire not only burns, but also corrupts and defiles and makes the earth that it hits completely unmanageable for their on. It is a reminder that black spiral dancers are not that far from the tree. I've never seen one black spiral dancer have an act of mercy. I've never seen one black spiral dancer decide that one of his cousins should survive just because they're connected by blood. Uh, leave this Fianna, let the Fianna go, let him march off into the forest and tell his tales. No, the black spiral dancer will still decapitate the Fianna, but the black spiral dancer is still a werewolf. Let us not forget that. Let us not get too close. The werewolves are the thorn on our side. They are the ones who are preventing us from getting what we want. <laughs> Black spiral dancers are still werewolves. Just because they claim to fight for the worm, and just because they do a good job of it. We know that werewolves are temperamental. We know they cannot be controlled. We know that as soon as the Garo Nation has been terminated, the Black Spiral Dancers will turn on us. They do see themselves as predators, and oh, they are. Matched only by Red Talons or Ghetto Fenris, the Black Spiral Dancers are predators, which is why we need to be at the apex. We need to be at the top of the food chain when that happens. We need to be able to destroy the Black Spiral Dancers swiftly, effortlessly, which is why we need to gain their trust, we need to home them where we can see them, in pens but gilded, let them lay back on their sloth, on their feelings of victory, have them in Pentex housing that's just rigged to go up when the time is right. If we know where they live, we know where we can hit them. And that's all there is to it. Until that time, the Black Spiral Dancer is your friend. Do not dismiss them. Work with them, of course. Give them a half of your pay, otherwise they will get angry. Lead them to where whichever Garu nests you're familiar with, because they will always want to be the first on the scene, and we'll take your head off if they are not. They do take st uh, kill theft very seriously. Respect the board of directors. Dragon's Wrath and Francesco are not to be trifled with just because they're a little hairy and a little smelly and their eyes glow an unnatural green. Just be wary that one day or one night it will come a time that we have to turn our guns 
on our new friend.